In this reaction, the reacting materials are potassium permanganate, this dark purple solid on this screen, and glycerin, this thick liquid. Now let's see what happens when we mix them. Oh, there's some smoke coming off. Oh, look at the flame. Well, that reaction certainly releases energy, doesn't it? The key word is release. This is the type of reaction we call exothermic. This time, I want to do a reaction that takes in energy. Now, how are we going to see that? I'm going to mix barium hydroxide, a white solid, with another white solid, ammonium thiocyanate. Put the beaker onto the board right on top of that water. I'll keep stirring so that the reaction proceeds, and we'll see if we can tell whether or not energy is taken in. The beaker is frozen to the board. This is an example of an endothermic chemical reaction, one that takes in energy. In this case, the energy is taken in from the surroundings. 